What's up guys, and welcome back to Broken Age. In the last episode, we started Vela's story, and now we're gonna start the boy's story. Don't know much about him, so hopefully it'll be cool. Oh. Hey, rise and shine, son. You better get up. I'm almost off duty. Your mom's gonna be here soon, and you know how she is. But it's Saturday, Oops. come on. Here she comes. Have a great day, Shane. There's my little angel! Oh, computer, snooze. No more snoozies for my little spaceman this morning. Oh, I hope no bad tinkle fairies came and wet your bed during the night. Oh, computer, off. Come Just on five more minutes, Mom. Lots of important adventures to go on today. Get up now. I guess we'll get up now. <laughs> Alright, uh oh. What's up? Oh, she, she's waking me up herself. Okay, <laughs> this is a little interesting. So our mom is a robot and so is our dad? No, man. <laughs> we seem very unentertained by this. Hey, easy, computer. Oh, quit being so shy. I used to change your diaper. <laughs> this is so weird. Good morning. <laughs> so we live on a spaceship. That's like the coolest thing ever. Chocolate rockets? Okay, sure. Uh, wait, no, yeah, sure. there you go. What difference does it make? Oh, am I depressed? I sound depressed. Well, I mean, from what looks like I'm being babied when I'm obviously like 17 here. And whoa, who was that? Uh. Good morning, Commander Shay. Good morning. It is my honor to be your training spoon today. Can't wait to start mission nutrition. So just pick me up and we'll start filling you up with space fuel. Okay, then, so can something I move? Wrong, yep, okay, I, I guess I don't know how to use a spoon, man. Please say something, Commander. Okay, yes. there you go. <laughs> you be sorry, Commander. So I need to learn how to use a spoon. It's happening. It's really happening. Now, sir, I don't just serve food. I also serve up nutrition facts and eating encouragement. For instance, That's nice. that last spoonful was exactly 7.1 calories. Did you... Uh -oh. uh oh, what's happening? Uh oh, are we crashing? What's uh -oh. happening? Commander? Oh no. Aren't you excited to see what the big deal is? Up on the bridge? Uh, um, no. Not really, I well, guess. Then. Want to know the viscosity of this morning's synthetic milk? No. <laughs> he seems very un unenthused by everything. Okay, computer. What's the big emergency? I wish you'd call me Mom, sweetie. I wish you called me Captain, computer. Okay, Captain, sweetie. Let's get down to business. We are currently tracking multiple developing crises that need urgent attention. First of all, a massive avalanche has been reported on the planet Galactica. Second, there's a runaway train in System 7 that's headed for Spike Canyon. We've also received a Mayday signal from the vessel Friendship Circle. They're under attack. And, uh-oh, this just came in. My sensors are reporting an entity of unknown origin has attached itself to the hull of this very ship. Oh no. Your orders, we, uh, Captain? Uh, so we seem to be treated like a child. Hmm. We need to help those avalanche victims. I knew you'd want to help them, sweetie. Fly a course for Planet Galactica. Off we go. Is this place even real? Is there an actual mission going on? <laughs> Uh, that, that's a problem. It's worse than it looks. Really? How? It's an ice cream avalanche! <laughs> oh no! Yay! Yay. <laughs> that's a good thing. Then why is that's he helping him? Worse? <laughs> Everything is okay. Just eat it all away. Eat it all! Take Go ahead. Time. Eating isn't a race. It is when I'm in charge. Yay. Yay. He's just gonna eat it all? <laughs> He's going to have a big ice cream headache by the end of this. <laughs> oh my. Got a special nutrition paste for you today. Space meat in a blanket. Oh my. So like, we're mothered by a spaceship though? This is really weird. <laughs> he seems to have an uneventful Ready life too. exciting space mission, honey? We've got an avalanche, a runaway train, a spaceship under attack, and a mysterious object on the hull. Hmm, well, we just did the avalanche, I guess, so 
Why don't we try something else? Let's catch the runaway Let's train. Catch that runaway train. Aye, aye, Captain Sweetie. To System 7. Off we go. Uh oh, what's happening? Oh, the train that has the same inhabitants. Oh, oh, now we're manning it, so I guess everything's okay now. The bridge is way over there. The the he's not really a man, he's a mountain. This is a terrible thing to happen to us. Especially because it's so preventable. <laughs> it is. What is with these problems? Wake okay. up, bridge man! Where's there we go. No, <laughs> he really did something. He's quite the hero. <laughs> Nobody else could have done that. So wait, so we go into the mouth of the bridge man. What's gonna happen then? Oh no. Somebody's holding on. <laughs> they didn't want to go. Oh my. Oh no. What's happening? Thank you, brave hero. We should celebrate. I guess everything's okay. Whoa, this looks really cool. Absolutely. Reminds me of Space Mountain from Disney World. Aww. So we're just speeding off now? Oh, into the spiking area. What's going on? This is the weirdest thing. This is weirder than the last episode. You're welcome. You're going to love this dinner pill. Leftovers medley. Hmm. Oh, it was all right. <laughs> Doesn't taste like anything, seeing how it was a pill. We go on next, sweetie? All right then. Um, we have to defend the friendship circle, or better suit up and investigate that foreign body. Let's do the foreign body better one. Suit up and investigate that foreign body. Oh, I don't like you going out there. Let's use the safety suit. Ah, oh, come on. Hmm. Oh wow, we're going outside of the ship. I'm surprised we're doing something this relatively dangerous. Oh man. So what is the point of the spaceship? Like, I don't understand. Is it actually doing something or is it just manning this man child? <laughs> this is a silly suit. Oh wow, he seems very, this is the first time I've seen him intrigued by anything. Wow, I, I mean, I, I, I see why. It looks really cool out here. Okay. I'm outside the ship. The foreign body must be very close by. Hmm. Okay then. Why don't we hop off to this planet? Oh, not quite. <laughs> oh. Okay. What's over here? Hmm. What is this stuff? It's like some type of growth. That doesn't look good. Where's it going? Oh my. Hmm. Let's see. What is this? I found the object. It appears to be something organic in nature. Something's telling me I should stick my face right into it. <laughs> Great Get idea. Get off! Oh, it's a present! Hooray! Hmm, another boring day on the spaceship. Time for more adventures in Sleepy Land. Hey, any day without a real emergency is a good day, son. See you tonight, son. Good morning, Shay! So it's yet another day. Or how would we know? <laughs> it's space out there. So let's actually say no to things now. Let's be very negative. No, I don't want to see you. No. I think I'd rather eat a bug. Honey holograms. Hmm. Nope. No thanks, computer. Nappy lumps? No. <laughs> that sounds good, but no. Yuck. You know I hate that. Soylent dreams. Oh, okay, that doesn't sound good. No. Not in that kind of mood today. Crispy bunches of space. <laughs> what is with all these cereals that probably all taste the same? Man, that sounds horrible. Brain blasters? Who? No, 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 no. Ugh. Take that away. Strawberry comet trails. Maybe no. Please don't take this personally, but no thanks. Whole green nutrient paste? Oh, of course not. Are you kidding? Gross. Mutant munch. Oh, tempting, but no. Yuck. Are you even trying, computer? Galactic slime? How many cereals are there? <laughs> we have a big pantry. I'm allergic to that, aren't I? Splarg? 
What? Seriously, are you trying to... Oh my gosh. Splarg. Seriously? Are you trying to make me unplug you, computer? Oh, come on! You love Splarg! What is Splarg? Oh, she's giving me Splarg anyways. Like, she's not giving me a choice. She's like, you're gonna have Splarg and you're gonna like it. Oh my. Your saliva has a 0 0.001 pH imbalance today. May I suggest more whole grain nutrient paste? No thanks, and it's, so it's the same thing every time. I'm, I'm not really, you know, confused as why this guy is so bored now. Hmm. Let's try this one since we haven't done this one. I'm really confused. Maybe we're supposed to do something different? Hmm. Let's try it out. And maybe like after this, we'll just stop doing things in general. Like we won't like make the bridge for the train or something. Maybe we just need to retaliate. Vessel, friendship circle. I found one of the crew. Oh no. She's so sad. Let's see if everything's okay. Maybe what she has a tummy ache. From an enemy vessel? Or an alien creature? <gasps> or did you attack yourselves in a fit of space madness? It was a... Yes. <laughs> Very ingenious. <laughs> so just everything is so childlike, and this kid is just not a child anymore. Hmm. Ooh. So delicious. Not really. <laughs> so, I guess that what we just really need to do is retaliate and not humor these people anymore. It's like, what would happen if we go to the train wreck and just not do anything? Let's find out. No, no. Oh, no. I'm going to do absolutely nothing about it. Wake up the bridge, man. That's such a good idea. Nope, she's holding on now because she knows. Nope. I ain't gonna do it. I ain't gonna do it. You can let go now. I got this. <laughs> you can let go now. I got this. I'm not letting go until that bridge is down. Hmm. I think I should open it. Well, we're stuck in the snow. Better eat the other passengers. It's a little early for that. Why not yell at the bridge man first? Hmm. Maybe there's something else we can do, like eat the snow. Get ready. I'm going to throw you at the bridge man. I'm happy to volunteer for that suicide mission, sir. But I think if you just shout at the bridge man, he'll lower or raise that bridge. Hmm. So it looks like she's not letting go. I don't think she's gonna let go though. So let's um, let's try opening it. Well, yeah. Well, how do you open it? Uh. Oh, okay then. Nope. Okay then. I guess the, it's the only thing to do right now is to talk to this. All right. Back to sleep, bridge man. Oh, I see. I see. We did it. Ah! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> what were you thinking? You could have saved us so easily. Until you had to be there. <laughs> whoa! Excitement! Woo! Uh oh! Whoa! Don't die! Don't die! No! That would just be a horrible way to end this all. Oh no! This was spiky. Oh, oh, I guess not. Having fun? Huh? Who are you? When you tire of child's play, when you're ready for real danger, come see me. But... Tell no one. Do you understand? Okay. But... No one. Hey! Wait! What? Hmm, so there seems to be an intruder in our midst when it comes to this spaceship. Looks like we've made some progress. It, young man. You need to rest and heal up in bed until further notice. Computer, I'm fine, obviously. No, you might have a delayed fracture. That can happen. If you say so. No, it can't. All missions are canceled. Oh no. <laughs> All right then, I guess I love you. it's time for bed. Good night, everybody. I hope you've enjoyed this episode of The Broken Age. And in episode three, we'll go back to Vela's story. But for now, we'll sleep away. Or will we? Find out soon.